Hey guys, I just wanted to check in. Oh, wait, let me take my glasses off. Then I can't see. Back. Sorry for the glare. Alright, you know, so it's the end of the day. I have been feeling wonderful today. And, you know, I'm catching up on my videos. I love all of your vlogs. All of your vlogs are awesome. Um, I seriously love all of this. I did not realize how much I was going to get out of this whole YouTubing thing, but I was just trying to follow HCG Chica's, like, recommendation on how to do this, and her number one thing was, like, you need support, and you need to join a YouTube or Facebook, which I don't do Facebook or anything else like that, so I was like, oh, I guess I'll do YouTube, <laughs> and I'm so happy that I did. But the real reason why I'm updating is I'm watching videos, and I'm just thinking about what an awesome freaking day I had, okay? Why? Why did I have such a good day? Um, well, you know what? I'm out of 150, but really just 1.6 pound release. I mean, really, how much smaller am I today than I was yesterday? Seriously, right? It was all here, right in here. And I'm watching my vlogs, and I'm watching Erica's video, and I'm like, man, this sounds like just like what we were talking about last night, right? We were on the phone for what, at least an hour. I mean, I'm like, dude. This is like verbatim, so I'm watching, I'm watching, and at the end, she's like, you know what, I already said this yesterday to Sarah, and we had like a light bulb moment, seriously. And you know what I told her, you guys, seriously, yesterday, when she was telling me everything that she just professed to you guys on the vlog, we were just going back and forth, and I said, and she's like, you know what, Sarah, like, you gotta stop being like negative because I was like you know I'm on my second round of 21 days like and people aren't gonna lose I'm not gonna lose like I'm not gonna lose anymore and she's like no 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 like stop stop that like if I'm gonna say to you what I say to my kids if you think you can't you can't if you think you can you can so simple right so we're talking and I'm like you know what Erica, seriously, like every time I get on that scale in the morning, it's time for me to wake up five o'clock in the morning and I'm like, oh, I'm not going to see under 150 today. I'm not, not today for whatever reason. I'm totally pop. I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. You know what? I'm on 30 day 38. Just not going to see it. It's not going to happen. And I said, you know what? I have been thinking that and I've been doing it as a protection so that I wouldn't be so, so, so upset when it didn't happen. And she's like, you see? And it's not happening. I was like, all right, I'm going to say it right now, girl. Tomorrow I'm waking up and I'm going to be under 150. I'm going to say it and that's it. She's like, say it, girl. Say it. Own it. You're going to do it. And what happened this morning? Under 150. Now, it could be a coincidence. Believe me, I am like the least spiritual person ever okay I'm sorry I'm just not I don't mean to offend I don't believe in a lot of things okay I'm not saying any of that is it a coincidence sure I'm the biggest skeptic out there okay I don't believe in much but you know for a person who doesn't really believe in much that has to be a little bit more than coincidental you know what I mean whatever maybe it was the time for me to go down on the scale but isn't it just fun to change your mindset isn't it just a little bit better to just be more positive about it you know in hcg chica's workbook she says like just don't have a lot of expectations don't don't compare your journey to somebody else and and you'll be successful you will be and you will de you will define that success by something different it's going to be specific specifically tailored to yourself right so today, back to my day, super awesome day. I mean, oh uh, my God, back in my day before I was carrying my extra weight, right, which I'm not too far from, you know, maybe about 10 pounds lighter, let's see, 149, 10 to 14, 15 pounds, I was, I was happy. But I would go out and get compliments. I mean, I'm not conceited by no means, but I mean, people would compliment, oh, love your shoes, love your glasses, love your hair very nice outfit and I loved it but for a long time those compliments went away like I didn't get them anymore and I felt it you know being heavier and gaining weight and dressing frumpy and hiding and oh it was so horrible but guess what today I got a compliment I was at the market and some lady walked by and she was like cute shoes girl and I'm like thank you 
Now, it had nothing to do with because I'm 1.6 pounds less than yesterday. You know why? Because I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm walking around. I'm smiling. I'm making eye contact with people. I'm like strutting my stuff. And people respond to that. So thinking off what Erica was saying yesterday about your mind and the power of your negativity and what you profess you'll get, you know, again, not the most faithful person here. I don't believe in a lot of the, anything, but living that today and just seeing how I truly felt and like the radiance that comes off and then in return, people see that and they're like, hey, you know, compliment for you. And I'm like, oh my God, totally awesome. Thank you. So I just wanted to share um, a little bit of happiness and hope that it spreads out to all you guys because you totally deserve it. And, you know, it's easy to say, but I, I do want to say something, though. It's really super easy to have a very upbeat attitude when you drop some weight. And for me, for going into a new decade, so easy for me to be so super happy, right? I'm not, you know, for now I'm, I'm I'm living this joy and I'm appreciating it, but you know, I'm Sarah and sometimes I'm up and sometimes I'm down. So, hey, you know, if, if something horrible happens, oh, hey, you know, there, I can't do that. I cannot. That's what I'm just trying to talk about. I cannot profess that something bad's going to happen a week from now and I'm going to be all negative. That's what I got to work on. So I'm not even going to finish that statement. For now, I'm going to just bask in my positive energy and hope that it spreads to all you girls. All right, bye.